Good evening. Our conductor for this evening is Mr. Casey Lunsford. Mr. Lunsford is the current president of the IRSC Mueller campus in Bureau Beach. He is a highly sought after adjudicator and clinician across the state of Florida. Prior to his current position on campus as president, he served as the director of bands at Port St. Lucie High School for eight years where he had started the program. Following his tenure at Port St. Lucie High School, he was the director of bands here at Indian River State College for four, seven years, sorry. Please join me in welcoming Mr. Casey Lunsford.
been a big fan of Roberts ever since. He's a great guy, great person, uh, great ambassador of music education. So again, a Florida connection here. Our next piece is called Overture to a New Horizon.
third selection this evening is a, is a pretty ballad. It's called Old Scottish Melody, based on the tune Old Lang Syne. Uh, the only Florida connection I have here is that I had the pleasure of conducting this. Uh, my very first band at Port St. Lucie High School in 1989. We had no seniors in the band our first year down there, and this one was a selection that we used to play at MPA, so it's had a special place in my heart because that was a great group of young people. There were about 70 musicians the first year. Uh, again, no seniors. We were out there, and uh, it was a lot of fun. So this is a piece that we selected that year to play, and then so it brings back a lot of special memories. It's a good group to use. It features trombones, and as you can hear, we have a really good trombone section, so whew, I was lucky on that. So this is Old Lang Syne, also in our ring, called Old Scottish Melody. Thank you to the band directors. 
for providing these wonderful students for us, and thank you for music education. We talked a little bit about this with the students today. You know, last year and a half, two years, we haven't had this kind of interaction. Uh, whether we like it or not, education is going to be online. It's virtual. It's here to stay. I'm the campus president. Uh, our enrollment hasn't come all the way back yet either. We've been open all year, but it's here to stay. But one of the cool things about music education, we have to socially interact. And we're, as a species, as a human species, we interact. All I have to do is archaeologically go back and look and see all the different cave dwellings and carvings of people together. And I was telling students, this is an activity of social interaction. And this is very important, not only for music education, but education in general and for society. So I encourage them to keep playing. Uh, I told them to go back next week and tell everybody that it was a wonderful experience. You had the best band director of all time and all that. But I don't think they're going to say that. But it's what it's called. <laughs> and uh, then the other thing is to keep on playing. Keep playing. Whether they go to college, uh, you'd be surprised how many students are in college bands that aren't music majors. And then if they don't, they go into the workforce, to find a community band. We have several up and down the coast here, in, in each of our counties on the coast. I encourage them to play. It's fun to do that. You have 18 year olds to 80 year olds. And I had an experience once of conducting the Palm Beach County Band that was in my high school band. First three clarinet players were professional clarinet players. I couldn't tell them a thing. With their dentures falling out and everything, they still could play. It was wonderful. <laughs> so uh, I encourage them to keep playing because it's a lifelong, uh, lifelong habit here. They've learned a foreign language. Continue to use that foreign language, our language of music. Our final number is called Prelude Sicilian Rondo. It's a three movement work by Malcolm Arnold. Uh, it's a wonderful piece. John Painter did the arrangement. And my thought to this is that Dr. John Salwell, our clinician here, uh, was honored two years ago with being inducted to the Hall of Fame at the Midwest Band Clinic. And Dr. Painter is one of the original founders of that up in Chicago. So again, my mindset was on picking music that had a connection to us and our region. And uh, so I want to thank John. I want to thank his staff. They've been wonderful to work with. Thank you to the directors. Thank you to the kids. Thank you to the parents. It's been a pleasure. Thank you.